Flathead Lake is one of the biggest lakes in this section of the valley. Um, there's housing and development all the way around Flathead Lake. So to keep it pristine is important for, for everybody in the valley. One of the primary goals of the project was to protect Flathead Lake. That was important to the district, that was important to the residents of Big Fort. And so that was one of our largest goals. The existing gravity sewer main that ran through the bay along Big Fork Bay was failing. The district was really worried about it overflowing into the lake. There's a public dock that is right next to this sewer line and so they knew they had to do something. So the original sewer system had been installed at a time in the 60s when there was an access road that went along the lake. It was between the lake and all the properties there. Over the years the properties started encroaching on that and building decks and things like that. Buildings were built up next to the sewer main off five feet off of the sewer main and so reconstructing a gravity sewer through that corridor was not possible. So we looked at alternatives and all-terrain sewer was one of the alternatives that we looked at. Um, it helped because we could install the, the pumps down at the lake where it was limited access for construction equipment. We were able to get construction equipment down there to get the pumps installed and then we were able to directional drill the pipes down into there where it was really an area where it's really tight. So there was two main reasons that we went to an all-terrain sewer. Um, the first was maintenance um, because they couldn't access the sewer because of all the buildings. The second was the gravity sewer was failing. It had bellies in it and it receives a ton of grease from downtown and the all-terrain sewer allowed us to remove that component and pump so that there's no maintenance on the on the lines themselves. These types of systems are sealed systems. They have uh, force mains coming off of them that have no joints. They're usually solid pipe going directly to the city sewer. Um, so they're a real sealed tight unit. We looked at replacing the gravity where it was and determined that the feasibility, constructability was not possible through the corridor. Installing the pumps down by the lake with the um, plastic collection basins was huge because we didn't have to have big equipment to drop that uh, materials down there. There was 24 grinder stations installed as part of the project. There was, there was some questions at the very beginning when um, you take somebody and you take them from a conventional gravity where they don't have to pump and tell them that, oh, by the way, we have to install a pump and uh, you're going to be responsible for maintaining it. And so we went around to the community and really talked to everybody and made sure they understood what it was and how, how it worked. And then as part of the project, we also purchased the five-year um, warranty and installed the controllers that would connect to the cell system so that if there was a problem, someone would be aware of it and could come fix it right away. E1 stands behind their product really well. These pumps are very robust. They seem to take abuse pretty well, um, and they last a long time. We have had instances where other pumps have failed, and we decided that this product would be a good fit for the replacement, um, and so we have swapped these over. We've also seen where these stations were already set up in E1, and they did a conversion. We have since gone back and, and pulled those and put E1s back into those stations. I really appreciate all the support that I've gotten from all of E1's uh, uh, collective crew, I mean, between uh, support staff over the phone, um, our representatives that handle shipping and receiving the pumps, it seems to be smooth all the way through. So the all-terrain sewer is going to start, I, I believe, to be the first go-to choice with the uh, property that's left and the, the areas that are wanting to be developed now are just far enough away um, from city sewer that the all-terrain sewer makes perfect sense.